Hello and welcome to the last episode of Exchange TV 2018. In the last round of workshops, you took part in spoken word, improvisation and puppetry. Let's take a look. We're currently in Martin O'Connor's workshop looking at uh, what are words worth, just looking at poetry, slam poetry, uh, spoken word, uh, just making prose and stuff like that. It's all about um, looking at stories and your own ideas and other people's words and their ideas and then forming it into a spoken word poem. We are looking at different tools that we can use to make poetry, so the ways in which we research poetry as well. Um, looking at photos, looking at newspapers, uh, getting conversations going with other people. I've let go and it never felt so good. A perspective, die and let live. I think um, it's really important, particularly the verbatim side of it, it's really important to get other people's stories and so you're not just constantly in your own head. We are currently in the midst of Quizula, which is an endurance performance. We set rules but without talking about it or defy the rules. Um, and we also have a list of questions. For example, uh, how do people sweat? Or are you sure? I think some are really deep questions, some are really simple questions. Sometimes kind of you just get a little group on their own in a, in a corner that have been asking each other questions for ages and really kind of learning about each other and bonding. There's some people just kind of wandering around and every time they encounter someone they just ask a new question and it's really interesting to watch and also be a part of. We're doing this workshop about puppetry and we're learning about how different materials take on life and how they move, what they like to do, what they don't like to do and then how you can build a character on top of that. They're showing us how different materials move and how a single material can be manipulated to create a life. Being inspired by the feel of the material as to what characteristics you're going to give to the actual <laughs> puppet. I'm enjoying learning how, how to make something out of nothing, how to make a life out of just a piece of material. I just find it fascinating how something so lifeless can be so full of joy that you forget that someone's actually manoeuvring it. We've enjoyed brilliant performances all week from you guys. And we closed off the week with Oval House's powerful Austerity in Me and Eden Court Collective's energetic Game Face. The show is focusing on the effects of the government cuts which resulted from the financial crisis in 2008. Took in a lot of sort of dance movement and also singing and chanting and it was a really sort of empowering show. They made really cool use of the, the paper, so they wrapped everyone up in the paper and then they made rips as they kind of said like, this is what austerity has done to me, this is how it's gone. So it's kind of shown this disconnect between everyone and they had this really kind of cool white light which kind of made everyone seem equal. Rather than being quite linear and just following one story, they used lots of different kind of characters going simultaneously, so they had kind of different scenes going on at the same time so that kind of showed how it's affecting everyone and kind of at the same time. I think like the aesthetic really worked as well, yeah. just like the white and, and the visuals and the video. The, the uh, poetry that they repeated um, halfway through the show and then yeah, at the end. In, in the audience. It was, it was kind of filled with facts but was so personal. Everything about it was a really excellent show. A game face was awesome and it was a great way to finish the, uh, the festival experience. It's a super high energy, really fun piece about competitiveness and the pleasure it can bring on stage. It's completely different because it wasn't just like people on the stage performing, they were actually doing sports activities on the stage and it's something that I've never seen before. So it, I just kind of my brain just went boom. I was like, what's going on here? Because it's something, nothing that I've ever seen before. It was pure energy. It was unbelievable. It was a homage to the beauty of com the competitive nature of performing to some extent. I really liked it because it ended everything on a very, very uplifting note and everyone seemed very happy at the end. And it just, it was a very good end of the whole week. And I just, it was great. I really loved it. Thank you to all of you for being a part of Exchange 2018. Goodbye! Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> that works. <laughs>